Hi everyone, Spider-Man here. Well, as you know, yesterday I found them seven assassin bug nymphs. Uh, they're all doing perfectly fine. So, it's time to give them a feed. I'll feed the first two. And then I'll probably feed the first, the other four off camera. And then I'll feed the last one. So you don't really want to see me feed all of them because it's going to take too long. So yeah, let's um, first feed the first two. And as you know, I have got that uh, roach colony just down the bottom there. Uh, let's have a look and grab some little nymphs. So everyone, I've took the top off my uh, roach colony and um, I'll give them some uh, bug gel just down there. And you can see all the, uh, the Uthicas, the eggs there. Loads of them all light laying around everywhere. These are... A little bit annoying to have as they climb the plastic and there's one eating the uh, bug gel there so I'll be using the little nymphs if I can try and find some I just gotta watch the adults don't decide to climb out because they can be a bit of a pain um, a little bit, can be a little bit difficult oh, there's one there look. So let's uh, get seven of them nymphs and uh, feed the assassin bug nymphs. So everyone, as you can see, I've got a few roaches there to do my little feeding video of my assassin bug nymphs. So I've got uh, six there and one just there. So let's uh, give the first one a feed. So everyone, let's feed the first one. Let's just take the uh, top off. Yeah, and there's the first one just there. So let's uh, give it a roach. Let's see if it's let's see if it's hungry. Should be. I've oh, never actually had um, assassin bug nymphs before. So there, small enough. Oh, there we go. There's the uh, first attack, everyone. So that's the first one done. So let's go on to the uh, let's go on to the second one. So everyone, next up is the second one. Now this one's probably about the biggest one out of the seven. This one is a lot bigger. So let's uh, get a rope. See if it's a uh, oh, so just drop the rope on the floor. Don't really want to do that because it took me ages to get them. <laughs> Zoom in a little bit for you guys. I'm just on standby just in case the uh, assassin bug decides to um, run off. It's very useful to have a uh, a colony of roaches. Just as you keep going to the pet shop every time and try and breed some yourself, just save a lot of money. Gonna have a second attack. Oh, don't think he knows what to do. Oh, there we go. Second attack everyone, so that's not too bad. So what I'll do is I'll feed the other four off camera. And then what I'll do is I'll feed the uh, the last one. And um, I won't be too long. 
So everyone, I thought I'd do another feeding. feeding. We get a uh, another attack. Let's just hold this limb up. Give it a little touch. Oh, oh! It's definitely one it. Hey, there we go. Another attack, which is nice to see. From all our lovely subscribers. So yeah, a few attacks. That's not too bad. So, I'll leave them for uh, three or four days and then I'll feed them again. So everyone, I've fed the other four. So this is number seven. Here goes. Let's see if it's uh, going to eat today. Should do. That one's a fairly big one. Sorry about me sniffling. Uh, I think it must be my uh, apophysis uh, abdominal hairs. <laughs> Got up my nose from yesterday. Uh, all the other ones have been eating perfectly fine. So hopefully we'll have seven attacks out of seven all in all obviously like I said I didn't film every single one because it would just take way too long and uh, can be a bit of a pain can be a bit of a long waiting game It'd be nice if the nymphs stayed this colour as they grow to adults. That'd be uh, very uh, fascinating. Let's just give that roach a little touch. So I don't think that last one's hungry yet. But um, I'll leave the uh, I'll leave the roach in there. Just in case. No, I don't think that one's hungry, but I'll leave it in there. Might have it a little bit later. And uh, thanks for watching, everyone.